Hey guys, in this video we'll be going through another one of the Jack X races. For this one we'll be going into the Yellow Eco Cup. And then into Spargus. From there into the Wasteland Isle. This is another arena event. For this one we'll be doing the Capture Race. I'll be using the Daxamobile, but you can use whatever vehicle you prefer. Let's mix it up. The goal of the capture race is to pick up the power cell and take it back to your base. In this race you have a team of two others. They'll help you to pick up the power cell and take it back to your base. This will be the same for your opponents. If you can, pick up the power cell yourself, as your teammates can be very unreliable at actually delivering it. To get the gold medal and win, you need to be the team that reaches 50 first. There are a couple different ways to earn points. The most obvious is by capturing a power cell. This will give you 10 points, but also for every kill you get, you'll get 1 point each. If one of your teammates picks up the power cell, I will often hang around the middle area where the power cell spawns waiting for them to capture it. Another way to handle when your teammate picks up the power cell is to follow them very closely. Your opponents will start chasing them down and you'll be able to pick them off for a few extra points. When you go to capture the cell you need to be very careful. There is a slight bump just before the capture point and if you go in with too much speed you'll capture the cell and then go straight into the water. It's best to slow down a bit just before you go in. Before you capture one, you can also let your opponents get a lot closer to you. This way, when the next power cell spawns, they won't be as close to it, and you might be able to beat them before they get there. I tend to just focus on capturing power cells as much as possible, and disregarding everything else. There is also a 4 minute time limit on this race, so as long as you have the most amount of points by the end, you'll be fine. Just try and learn the track layout as much as you can. There are a few overlapping tracks which you might get confused and lost between, but if you look closely at the minimap, you'll be able to see which parts overlap what, and how to get around them. Another one fights the dust. And there we go. Hope it helps. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.